Hi my friends, welcome to another video of me pinning down my art dots. This is episode four, if you will. We're on the 800s, if you remember from last time, if you were here. So we're getting there. Not too many more left to go. Okay, we're starting on this row right here. I still got a lot of space, so I brought out my third box in case we need to get into that one too. Oh, and we're off to a good start. <laughs> I am spilling all over. Let me get this into my tray here. How are you guys doing? You guys probably won't see this video for a while. I've got other videos that I need to upload. Um, because I'm going through my whips pretty quickly. Um, this month for April, um, I, I, I was talking about how I was gonna talk about my April goals. So I thought I would mention those in here. So my goals for April, March was a lot of, um, I did two large paintings, they were both square. And then I did a small round painting. That sound you hear is my washing machine, sorry. Um, and so, you know, I was looking around at my stash and I'm like, you know what I haven't been focusing on are my smaller paintings. Um, smaller as in they're, they're not 30 by 40s they're a little bit bigger than that but uh and as you know if you've been watching my channel i've already started on the rows um i'm sure i'm done with that by now by the time this video comes out i'm sure i'm on another whip but it occurred to me that i just i hadn't been focusing on my smaller paintings um and so I thought for April, what I would do is, is small paintings. Now, most of the small paintings that I have, I think all of them actually, are round drills. Um, there's a couple that I looked up online and I can't find an artist for the paintings. So I'm assuming that they are some type of stock image. Um, I think that's what that means when you can't find the artist's name. So um, I'll be doing three of those because they're part of a set. It's a coffee series. Like I said, I can't, I can't find it. I can't find them. Um, online i did a google image search and nothing comes up so i mean the picture comes up but an artist's name does not come up so uh i think i'm safe with that and then there's a couple other ones i think there were a, a total of four goals that i had but one of the goals contained oh my gosh what is going on with me today one of the goals has, um, oh, let me put this in here first and then I'll scrape these off, has three paintings in it. So, but I am going to count each one of those as a whip because they are 30 by 40s. It's just, I counted them all in one goal because they're part of a set. And I, I've already done one of them because it actually came with four um, and then I have a paint gem mini set that I'm doing. You guys probably will have already seen that one too. It's the mandala. So I'm doing that on the side. So yeah, um, there's not going to be any large paintings from me this month. I do have one diamond art club that I'm going to do for Earth Day. which is, I believe, I keep meaning to look it up. I think it's on April 22nd. Okay, 826. So, 
Yeah, Earth Day is a special day. I feel like it's a special day. So I don't know how I'm gonna work that, if I'm gonna like start, because I need to go look at the size of that painting to determine, okay, let's move some of these. It's time to move some. Over here. You guys like that. How are you guys doing today? What are you guys up to, huh? You guys wake up on the right side of the bed today. Hope you guys are doing well. I hope this video makes you feel better if you're not feeling well. It's nice and relaxing to watch a kidding down video, I think. Kidding up or kidding down. I find it very relaxing and I like it when I'm diamond painting, especially if it's a longer video. Like I've said in the past, because it gives me a longer time to diamond paint without having to look up or change to another, you know, video. So this video should be about 40 minutes, I'm guessing. 45 minutes, maybe. That's a good chunk of time. Because I'm going to try to do four trains like I did last time. I'll be glad when this is over. But I'm already at the 800, so I'm getting there. There's a lot of 900s and a lot of 3800s, though a lot. I think I told you guys there's like 60 something 3800s. Yeah. So there's a lot. We had a busy morning kind of. I was doing a bunch of chores and we had our farrier come over to cut our goat's hooves. She is a unicyclist, and apparently she's like getting really good at it. She has her own YouTube channel, and um, she's had events actually contact her. Um, they want her to come to their event. So I'm really, really happy for her. She's actually the same age as my son. But yeah, she had an event contact her all the way in Arkansas. So she's gonna be going there, which is super cool. And we had a, I can't even imagine riding a unicycle. <laughs> I am so not coordinated. She says she's not coordinated either, but I find that hard to believe because she's really good on the unicycle. She showed me a video where she's like doing a, she's turning in a circle and she's scraping her hand on the ground. She's wearing gloves. She's literally scraping her hand on the ground while she's doing a, going in a circle on a unicycle. Oh my gosh, like what? And I guess she's, she's like taken it up to like 56 miles an hour before. That's just insane. I would be too scared to do that. She does wear a helmet and all that kind of stuff, but still. I'm too scared of that kind of stuff. But she's been practicing for a long time, so. Good for her. And then we had a, we just, we bought a new TV, like, I don't know, a month or two ago. Cause TVs are so cheap and we needed a, a 4K TV cause we, our TV was so old. And we were gonna take it to Value Village. It still works. It's a really good TV. It still works. It just didn't have 4K and, um, we were gonna take it to Value Village. It's like a 48 inch, so it's not small. And it's one of the, it's one of the, it's old enough to be like heavy. 
And I'm like, do you want a TV? And she's like, I've been looking for a TV. And I'm like, you're kidding. So she took our TV. So now we don't have to worry about taking that to Valley Village. I still have so much stuff to donate though. I have a bunch of um, diamond paintings to donate that I'm donating. And I had to package them up because I store my drills separate from my paintings. So I had to go through all of them. And then also I had gotten rid of the, um, you know, the little green boats that come with it and the wax and the pen, but I found some. So I had to get it all like in a, I got, I managed to get all of the paintings in a storage bag, a gallon size storage bag with a kit, all the drills and, um, the painting so worked out really good so it'll be perfect for somebody I hope that somebody is excited to see those I feel good about that today's weather is a typical spring day we have had pouring down rain we have had it be completely dark outside we've had sun We've had mist. Yeah. Just your typical Washington State April day. It's not, well, it was kind of chilly outside. Okay, rainy. Okay, 844, it's just, behind there. This must be 822 or 842. And I didn't see, I threw away the bag. I need to not do that. <sighs> threw the bag away, the baggie before I checked it. Okay. 844. Yes. I just, I get ahead of myself and then I throw my scissors all over. Oops, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I'm, I'm not used to this new tripod yet. Hold on. Ah. Okay, can you still see me? I'm so sorry. Hopefully you were diamond painting, you didn't see that. Pretend you didn't see it. Nobody saw it. Okay, 90. You guys are right next to me. My elbow is like so close to the tripod. But this way of filming is so much better. So much better. Yeah, my washing machine's really loud because I sit right underneath it almost, practically directly underneath it here in the kitchen. So we don't have much going on. We, we're having that car picked up tomorrow. Oh, and we have to, they're coming between 8 and 12. Oh my gosh, you guys. That's so early for us. 8 o'clock. Like, we will have gotten, like, how many hours of sleep? Five hours of sleep? Not looking forward to that. At all. Yuck. I was... If I don't get enough sleep, I kind of feel sick. Does that happen to you guys? Do you guys kind of feel like, kind of like you're sick? That happens to me. This row's getting pretty tight. Might have to move some of them over to the other row. Where would be a good place to stop though? At 895, maybe. This is 893. So 894. Is this even gonna make a difference if I do this? 
Oh, there's still stoppers back here. Okay. Yeah, that'll make a little bit of a difference. Little wonky. Okay, uh, eight ninety four. Okay, pretty pink. By now, hopefully you guys, well, some of you don't watch all of my videos, so um, my Art Dot Rose painting, I don't know if you guys have seen it. If you have, then you'll know what I'm talking about, but are there more things back here? No. Oh, it was just the sound of the phone board. Um, pad really bad. I'm working on it right now, so it's like really, really fresh in my mind. <laughs> um, the symbols were, okay, Rainy, don't, 8.95. The symbols were like really hard to read. And I ran out of two colors. I ran out of two ABs. There were three ABs, I ran out of two. Actually, I might even run out of the third one. I don't know because I'm not finished with it yet. So, I don't know. And I remember thinking too, wow, there's not very many. I think I even said it when I was kidding up the video. I think I even said, wow, there's not very many ABs. Which, you know, sometimes paintings don't come with a lot of ABs, but I was right. You know, I'm thinking all of these can fit in that last row now that I moved them all around. Because I kind of want to start the next... Wait a minute. I'm just noticing that this starts with 951. What did I do? Did I put them in another... Did I put them in this box? Yes, I did. Okay, so let's put these back over here so I can start this even though it's a little tight. It's not that bad. Okay, 900 and it goes all the way to, yep, okay. Not a big deal. Hold on if you can't see me. Just grabbing these from the other box. Okay, now we're on 900. So it, yeah, that'll be better to start this with 900. Uh, see how much room I have in this last box, so I'm hopeful. I really need to order some more um, square ABs. I'm gonna do it today. I'm just gonna bite the bullet and do it. Because I haven't, as of filming this, I haven't started the mandala, mandalas. I haven't even kitted them up yet. You, you will have seen the kitting up. But um, I haven't yet. And I am like, well, I need some ABs. And I kind of need to see the colors that they have. So that when I'm on DP with sparklers, I can pick out the, the correct colors because I kind of want to get some um, pixie dust too. So, because I just love the fairy dust. Pixie dust, fairy dust, I'm assuming it's the same thing. I'll turn to the greens now. 904. That'd be great if I could get all the 900s in this box, but fat chance, I think. I don't know. Never say never. And we'll start with this strand. This is our second strand. Where are we for time, too? At 19 minutes, and I'm, I'm almost done with my second strand. That's doing pretty good.
But yeah, the Brecking guy is coming tomorrow, and they they call before they come and ask you a couple of questions. So we will know for sure when he's going to be here. Nice and sunny outside right now. It's just pouring down right. Last night we had thunder and lightning. Coco and I were playing and we were having a really good time and then boom. When she was done playing, she wanted to hide underneath the blanket after that. I don't blame her. So, kind of ruined our fun game session. We're playing with her, one of her toys. So these are all green. Okay. You would think I would get used to these colors after doing the rounds. And now, and now the squares. And just painting in general. I've given up on finding out all the names to all the colors. The The paintings that I do, I tend, I tend to usually have the same colors over and over again. For $37.99, um, $33.71, $310, I always have $310. I know the color name for that. <laughs> but I am getting into color, more colorful pictures. So I have this one painting that I'm dreading. I mean, I, I still want to do it, but I'm like, oh, I'm going to have to pick like a really good time for me to do it. Like in the summer or something, but I already have one plan for the summer um, that's going to take me the whole summer, probably, or at least it'll at least take me a month to do the whole thing, but um, it's called the Judgment Card, and it's by Ennis Guerrero, and literally it's all black, like, you, it is all, I, I, I wonder how many 310 bags there are in that kit. We're on, we're on train three already. Um, I bet there's like 20 bags. I'm not even kidding. The whole thing's black. It's a woman and she's holding like a horn, like a really long elongated horn and the moon is in the background and it looks like there's an eclipse happening. It's a really pretty picture, but it's literally just black and grays. There's no, I don't think there's any color in it. So that'll just be, and it's big, it's big too. It's a big painting. So that's gonna take a lot for me to really hunker down and, you know, kind of brace myself for doing it. That's the only one in my stash where I'm like, hmm, that's going to be emotionally hard for me to do. Mentally hard for me to do, not emotionally. Because I've just been working on such pretty pictures. You guys probably also have seen my succulent kitting up. Um, I just bought some succulents, like I said, for my kitchen. I said this in another video and I ha happen to have a succulent painting with like, if you've ever heard of Hen and Chicks, which is a pretty popular succulent that people have in their gardens. And I thought, ooh, that'd be a cute little one for April. I don't offhand know the size of that. Again, it is a, it is bigger than a 30 by 40. I'm pretty sure. 
I'm hoping all of these will fit in this row because it goes to 950 in this row and that would be a nice place to stop. But it's just amazing how fast these fill up. I also was kind of contemplating maybe playing around with my blank canvas that I have. Maybe having that somewhere and working on it. Kind of on the side. I have a problem with working on more than one whip. Um, unless it's like a paint gem where it's like, oh, you know, this is like super tiny. Because I will work on a whip until I get... Like where I'm like, oh, I'm done diamond painting. You know, I don't tend to diamond paint on one whip and then go, oops, I'm going to start stop in the middle of my diamond painting and go work on another whip. I don't do that. Um, so, yeah, I, I don't know. I don't do that. I tried doing that and I was successful. For a while and then I was just like no like I would work on one whip and I'd be like no I want to finish this one first there's nothing wrong with that there's still I still have a painting that I started I don't know in August love last year that I haven't finished and I don't really want to finish it it's a skeleton and she's praying. She's got like a rosary and stuff. And at the time I thought, oh, this is a really cool painting. And now I don't. And it's just been sitting in my portfolio. I still have it kitted up. Because I'm like, you got to finish it. Like, I feel like pressure, like, well, you started it. You got to finish it now. Where did 926 go? Oh, this is just in the wrong spot. Okay, my mistake, 927. Pretty blue. So I don't know if I want to finish it or not. It's a 50 by 70, and I, I hardly have anything done on it. I just kind of got burnt out on it. It was just one of those where I was like, I don't really want to do this anymore. It's mostly blues. It's kind of like a, a blue and black uh, painting. That's me. The main colors are like blue, black, and gray. And it just wasn't, I don't know. I just, do you guys ever have a, a, have you come across a painting like that where you're like, I don't want to do this painting. Like you're still totally into diamond painting. You're not burnt out. But you just, you come across a kit where you're like, I don't like this painting. Have you guys had that happen? And yet I feel pressure to finish it because I'm like, well, you bought it. Like, you need to finish it. I'm like, there's no rules. Let's say I have to finish it. That thing can stay in there for five years for all I care. And I can't see it now anymore either. So it's not staring at me because I've got other projects that I've done that are on top of it. So I can't see it. So <laughs> it's not staring at me when I go in there to put another thing in my portfolio. Yeah, pretty soon it'll be time for me to diamond paint outside again. It's getting nicer and nicer. I don't want to fold that laundry, you guys. Ugh. I just want to throw it in the dryer and have it just magically like be put away. Is that too much to ask for? Nine thirty-two. Okay, this is getting really tight. The 900s really have a lot of greens in them, I'm noticing. Lots of greens. Oop, got the traveler here. Ah, 
as of this filming, I am waiting for a delivery that you guys would have already seen. And it is something that is brand new that just came out. It said it was supposed to be delivered yesterday by 7 p.m. Was it? No. It says UPS has it. So then I checked it today and it says, oh, it's supposed to be delivered by 7 p.m. tonight. I'm like, and it doesn't give me any details of where it is. Like it doesn't say... You know how normally you can look stuff up and it like tra it literally tracks it for you? Like, oh, it's here. It's in Seattle or wherever. It doesn't say anything like that. It just says, on the way. Ooh, I don't think I'm going to be able to do what I wanted to do here. I've got two more in this train, and I think that's going to be it for this row. We only have one more train left. Um, I'm going to have to move some over. Where would be a good to what number would be good there's not really a good number oh well, maybe we're doing okay because that would be awesome if I could get the 900s into just two rows because the 38s are there's just so many I'm thinking it's going to take up the whole box the whole next box I could be wrong Lord knows I'm wrong, like, so much. Okay, 938. We're on our last train. Brown. Yeah, so when I ran out of the colors for the, um, the rose, I ran out of, oh, why did I do that? It's 938. I know it's 938. Um, they were both ABs. I didn't have a substitute. So I did have the one AB I ran out of was yellow. And I had like an orange, which kind of went with the color scheme anyway. It really did. So I was like, okay, that'll work for that. But the other one, no, I had nothing that was even close to the color. I'm trying to remember what color it was. Um, was it, wasn't a green, I'm getting that confused with Natanya's Wonderland, but I didn't have anything close to that, so I'm literally just using regular drills that are similar to that color instead of using ABs, which kind of irks me because, like I said, it didn't come with very many ABs as it was. And I don't even know if I can contact them and be like, hey, I ran out of these ABs. I don't know how that works. I got this from Art Dot, but it was on Amazon. So I don't know how that works. I don't have the box anymore. Um, because I take my paintings out. Like I said, I take my paintings out so that I can flatten them all. I put them underneath my Diamond Art Club um boxes. <laughs> on a shelf. So it weights them down. And I put all my drills in a drawer labeled. So I don't know if I could even track that down to have them send me the stinking colors and it'll be too late anyway. Cause like I'm practically done with it. I don't want to wait. Oh, you guys, am I going to be able to do this? I don't know. It's so tight. No, I don't think I'm going to be able to because I've got. I've got a couple more before I hit 950. Nope, it's going to have to go in the other, other, I almost said drawer row. Get down. Get down on it. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, I'm just going to take these out. They're just doing that kind of made a difference. Okay. That sucks, but it's easy to find. Why not? 
Okay. So this was for 846. Okay, we have 847. Or, yeah, 947. Ooh, well, you can't always get what you want. Now that song's going to be stuck in my head. That's a good song to get stuck in your head, though. Oops. Today, I'm just going to... I really do need to put that laundry away. Gosh, come here. I'm just going to do some diamond painting. Like I always do. Okay, <laughs> hey, now we're at 9.50. Bummer. Darn, I really wish I could have gotten it over there on that side. I was so close, you guys, so close. Yep, my basket is, the art dot square drill basket is almost empty. It's getting down there. I can see the bottom of it. I'm excited because I want to use that basket for other things. Okay, 951. If you guys haven't, go check out my last whip that I did. Hopefully it won't be, hopefully it'll be the one that I'm thinking of. The gross foods, grossest foods. Cereal or soup. I love doing those whipping chats. I love the questions at the end. They're really fun. I hope you guys like them. I try to come up with a variety of different questions, but I only do a few, so there's not like a lot. I pretty much just talk about my diamond painting, then I talk about what's going on in my life, and then I do questions. Oh, oh my gosh, you guys, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I am getting used to this, this um, tripod. It's really skinny, but just the job. Like I said before, it comes with a remote, but I don't see the, the point in the remote. I can easily reach up and turn my phone on and off. It's not like you guys don't know that I'm turning my phone on and off. I'm not trying to be sneaky or anything like that. And I don't edit my videos, so I mean, it's it's fine. It's I don't I don't think people are like, oh my gosh, I saw her turn her phone off with her finger. I'm not watching anymore. And again, I just want to thank my subscribers, you guys. I got over 200 subscribers. I know that's like, you know, I'm a small channel still, but I thank you guys so much. Oh my gosh. I was so happy to get over that 200 mark. I've been working at this for like eight months, nine months now, and I only have like 200 subscribers. I'm like, am I not getting um, pushed on the algorithm? <laughs> but you guys made it happen. You guys are awesome. I love you guys. I'm so thankful to have you guys as subscribers. And if you're not subscribed and you like what you're seeing, please feel free to do so. It's free. I'll send you a video. <laughs> this one. Okay, 9.59. We only have five left here. 9.61. What are we for time? 
in my glasses. 40 minutes. Yeah, I was right. I said 40 to 45 minutes. Okay. Cool beans. Oh, if you want to see what I'm talking about with my canvas being really crummy with the symbols, the rose canvas, I made a one minute video. Just go back. I made a one minute video and I showed the canvas and you guys will see what I'm talking about. Ugh. It's, it, I mean, it's not fun. It's made it unpleasant to work on. Because I have to focus so hard on what symbol I'm on. And I only showed two of the symbols, but there's, there's several that are just really blurry or so close to each other in similarity that it's just, it's like, you can't tell. Somebody even commented and they were like, even if you took your phone and blew this up, it would be hard to tell. And they're right. Oh, oops. There we go. I have my extra drills over here that I that I've lost somewhere along the way today. Okay, two more. That was nine sixty-three. We've got nine sixty-four. These are all the nine hundreds. On, in here, the cards. So I'm thinking it might go partially into one of these rows over here, but then the rest can be for the 38s. And I might be able to, no, I think I've checked my boxes and I'm pretty much, I don't have any more room to move my stuff around. 966. This is our last one. Well, you guys, I want to thank you for watching today. I hope you enjoyed working on your diamond painting or whatever you were doing. So we left out at 966, so we're not going to start on 967 next. Maybe I'll do this. There we go. Now I know. And I enjoyed your company, and I will talk with you later. Loves.